One love to you beautiful deep divers of planet Earth. I hope you're taking care of yourself. I hope you're doing a little samba, baby. I woke up like this all magical and fly deep divers. Now, so much is happening in the world. We are living in a whole new world. And this is not Aladdin. Look, so many strange things are happening. Like if I told you Bigfoot came out of the ocean and said, can I get a hello there? You probably wouldn't be surprised because right now, you hear talk of UFOs and so many strange things are happening and we're in a whole new world, the metaverse and AI is accelerating in its capabilities. So a lot of people have kind of lost that feeling of being shocked, like I'm not surprised. <laughs> and it's got everything to do with the whole new world, the whole new age we are in right now, this age of Aquarius, the information age, the age of the water bearer, where the hidden is coming to light and the veil is being lifted. A lot of people are diving deep down the rabbit hole, really seeing that we have been living in a prison planet for thousands of years. And now people are like, hey, right now, I just want to be free. I just want to be free right now. And that's what's happening. <laughs> now, deep divers, the information I'm about to share with you is going to make you raise your eyebrows like the rock. Warning, if your mind can't handle this kind of truth, then I would probably skip this video. Let me repeat it one more time. If your mind cannot handle this kind of truth, then I'd probably skip this video because we are about to dive deep. Dorothy, buckle up your seatbelt because Kansas is going bye-bye. But first, let's breathe deep, divers. That was special. Let's go. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. What are we doing? Raising the frequency. You better be raising the vibration. Take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy I'm sending you. Deep divers. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. I hope you're taking care of yourself, deep divers. It is such a beautiful day. And I'm FaceTiming you right now. If you are watching this video, may something great happen for you today. I hope so, deep divers. Now, if your mind cannot handle this kind of truth, then I'd probably skip this video. I want everybody to hit that like button right now if you support the real. Hit that like button right now because somebody out there needs to see this. Someone sent me a message. They're like, Ralph, can you dive deep again? Add me on Instagram at Ralph Smart. Add me on Twitter at Infinite Waters. I said, don't worry. I'm going to dive deep. <laughs> It's a beautiful time to be alive, right? It's a beautiful time to be alive because so many huge shifts are happening all around the world. A great awakening is happening all around the world. Humanity is in a great state of change and change is the only constant. We are actually leaving one old age and we're entering a whole new age. And this is, this is the reason why a lot of people can feel like something big is about to happen like something major is about to happen. And that's because it's already happening. We're in the cycle of a whole new age. And this is the reason why nothing feels the same. It literally feels like we're living in a whole, we're living on a whole nother planet, right? Well, the information I'm about to share with you is gonna make you really go like, oh my gosh, Ralph, I can't believe it. You're gonna be inspired, amazed, and also outraged and also happy at the same time. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? So deep divers, let me share with you this very important message. If your mind can't handle this kind of truth, then I'd probably skip this video. First and foremost, much love to all of you wonderful deep divers. Much love to all of you wonderful deep divers out there. Let me just say this off the bat. We often think people on the red carpet are the real celebrities when in essence, the real celebrities 
are the ones who are standing up for humanity's freedoms. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. I said the real celebrities are the people who are standing up for humanity's freedoms. The light workers, the way showers, the people who are speaking truth to power and saying, hey, humanity, wake up to your greatness. These are the true celebrities. And I know a lot of you deep divers are celebrities. So I'm giving you your flowers. Like people give me my flowers. They're like, Ralph, thank you so much for changing my life. Right. And I'm here to do that. We are the real stars. Now, a lot of people know that there are so many great changes happening on the planet from earthquakes to a potential World War Three, Russia and Ukraine to We've just come out of a pandemic to so many things happening. UFOs to I can keep going on. Right. But one of the greatest things that's happening is the global awakening. Millions of human beings are realizing they are multidimensional beings having a human experience. Now, this is unprecedented because the awakening is happening every single second for Hundreds of millions of people. And it's the time for it because the ancients said, we are in the end of a cycle and we are approaching a whole new cycle. The Mayans call this time the end of time. But if you know one thing, in the universe there is no ending. There are only a new beginning. There are only new beginnings, right? And that's what's happening right now on the planet. We are entering a whole new beginning where a lot of humanity is for the first time saying, you know what? I'm more than this piece of meat, this flesh body. I'm actually the energy inhabiting it. And this powerful, it's so powerful to see because I get thousands of messages every single day and all around the world, people tell me about their experiences. They're like, Ralph, I'm in Brazil and we're having these amazing retreats and so many people are waking up. People say, Ralph, I'm in Ethiopia. A mass awakening is happening here. People say, Ralph, I'm in South Africa. Ralph, I'm in England. Ralph, I'm in France. I'm in Germany. Ralph, I'm in Trinidad and Tobago, right? People are all around the world are having this wake up call to the truth of who they really are. And this is powerful. This is profound because it's about time. You see, a great change happens when you realize that you are so much more than you have been told. I realize, Deep Divers, that I've been brainwashed. And when I realized this, this is when my great awakening started to unfold. It happened in 2006. And right now, because we're in the information age, the age of Aquarius, the water bearer, you're seeing documentaries which are making you, they're making you raise your eyebrows like the rock, like, oh my gosh, I didn't know this. Because we are in the apocalypse, apocalypse emanating from the Greek apocalypsis, which means a lifting of the veil. People are now realizing we've been lied to by governments, by the media, and a lot of people are no longer willing to believe everything they see or hear. Many people are now developing critical thinking because they're realizing everything we think we know about this planet is wrong. And this is why we are living in such amazing, transformative times of change. Are you excited, deep divers? I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> now, I want to tell you this. A lot of people say, Ralph, you're so authentic. And I say, that's good because authenticity means you can be yourself. It means you can be positive and also negative at the same time. I'm not a role model. I'm a truth model. I'm an authentic model. And that's what I strive to be. It's sad to say, but the fact still remains. So many people in this world 
aren't allowing themselves to be authentic. They're pretending to be someone else. They wake up every single day. They wear a mask because they feel that who they are is not good enough. But the moment you say, you know what? My authenticity is good enough. This is when you become your greatest version and everything makes sense. You've been told that it's never good enough. And nothing could be further from the truth. You see, right now on the planet, what is so amazing is that a lot of people are now embracing authenticity over fakeness. They're taking off the mask, the persona. They're allowing themselves to be naked, exposed and vulnerable. There's a strength in vulnerability. There's a strength in vulnerability. And this is huge because you see, people aren't drawn to your perfection. They're drawn to your realness, your authenticity. This is how you become captivating. This is how you become captivating. So when I realized when I first started making videos, I was just having a beautiful afro in my backyard, so authentic. And this is what drew people to me. And right now, a lot of people are realizing pretending on social media, on the internet, trying to be someone else is not going to get you anywhere. It's only going to leave you in a shambles. And now so many people are realizing that actually authenticity is what it's all about. I don't have to try hard. I already am. I said, I don't have to try hard. I don't have to try hard. I already am a masterpiece. And this is what humanity is waking up to. It is okay to be the work in progress and the masterpiece at the same time. And that's beautiful. So we know we've been brainwashed. People judge other people based on their skin color, their race, their creed. But what if I told you we are all one humanity? So when people ask me, my, when people ask me my race, I say, what do I say? I'm a planetarian. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. I'm a planetarian. I don't get caught up in Democrat or Republican, black or white. Because I realize that we are all connected. And they want to separate you. And when you realize that when you move beyond the separation, you now become extremely powerful, no longer controlled, no longer hating someone for no reason. And right now, when you have a potential World War Three with Russia and Ukraine, they were once brothers. A lot of Russians are in Ukraine. Ancestrally, it goes back. We were all one at one point, but then people are fighting for greed and ego. And what's happening right now on the planet is that humanity is at the crossroads. We can keep going the way we've been going and destroy ourselves into oblivion. Or we can say, you know what? It is time to put forward the ecosystem once again, instead of the ego system. A lot of people are realizing that they don't want to be a sheep anymore. They don't want to just blindly follow because for so long, people have been sheep. You've gone to school. I call it the first 18 years of trauma. But everything they teach you is about his story. It's not about yours. His story It's not about your story. They don't teach you about how to meditate. So by the time you're 18 and you finish school, you don't know who you are. you got more problems than when you actually first started because now you start judging people. And we have to stop being sheep and start following who we truly are. And that's what's happening right now. I call it the new renaissance. It's happening all around the world. Deep divers, if your mind can't handle this kind of truth, then I'd probably skip this video. I want to talk to you about the things we've been led to believe about the earth, which aren't true. Deep divers, I told you, we aren't the only intelligent life form on the planet. Are we intelligent? 
Are we intelligent deep divers? I have no idea because we are the only species that pays to live and eat, yet we are supposed to be the most intelligent. Never mind. <laughs> what if I told you life exists on other planets and this is the full disclosure? Check this out, deep divers. Earth 2, new planet discovered. This just came out. Wolf 1069b. Same size as our Earth. And Earth 2 has been discovered by scientists which shares the same size as our Earth and is said to likely have water on its surface as well as potentially being able to support alien life. Scientists say it is one of the most likely and nearest places to find ETs. Boffins have discovered a new planet hailed Earth 2 which they say could support alien life. Okay? The distant planet officially called Wolf 1069b is likely to have water on its surface. Its average temperature is thought to be the same as England's, the same as England's at 13 degrees Celsius. And like Earth, it orbits a star. And like Earth, it's, it orbits its star. It's 31 light years away. Now, this is huge because, like I say, life is everywhere. To think that we are the only intelligent life form on this in this whole universe is crazy. Right. So when your mind begins to open, you realize that, oh, my gosh, it's not just about human beings. It's about realizing we are a part of the web of creation. We didn't weave the web of creation. And these are the profound eye-opening discoveries and realities people are waking up to. Like, oh my gosh, so much is happening. Now, they might say a fake alien invasion, right? They might tell you an alien invasion. An alien invasion is happening. It might be fake, but what you do know is that we aren't the only life form anyway. So we have to start broadening our mind to this reality. Deep divers, if your mind can't handle this kind of truth, then I'd probably skip this video. We live in a world so fake, the truth actually scares people. And a lot of people have been merging with the metaverse. And that's cool. But don't get lost in it. Don't get lost in it. Because, you see, you can't replace real life. You can't replace real connection. You can't replace real air. But that's what they're trying to do. They want a world where you no longer are human. They want a world where you are an android, a humanoid, a cyborg that's hooked up to the mainframe and lose all trace of your humanity. This is what's happening. That's the reason why I always say, check your screen time. The average screen time is six hours and 58 minutes. In the US is seven hours and four minutes. You don't, even or, you don't even know a lot of you are already cyborgs. You better wake up. And that's why I choose my humanity over this artificial... I choose my humanity over this artificial insanity every single day. So the metaverse, a lot of people don't realize it's already happening with your iPhone. But it's up to you to say, you know what? Am I going to pull back and say, you know what, I don't want to go all the way into the metaverse because I want to actually connect with real people? Children are losing social skills. All of that time in lockdown, a lot of people still have trauma from that. Humanity needs to heal itself. And right now, it's a chance for humanity to reclaim its power, reclaim its freedom, and reclaim its common sense. You've been living in a prison, and it's time to get the hell out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if your mind can't handle this kind of truth, deep divers, then I'll probably skip this video. Now, relationships, right? That's what it's all about. And in today's world, a lot of people, men and women have been at war with each other. And the new awakening that's emerging is that actually men and women are compliments. We need each other. It's not about going against women it's not it's not about going against men it's about realizing we need each other and right now we all have to get mature to say you know what men have to respect women 
women have to respect men. And we have to coexist in harmony. You see, men and women go at each other because of a lack of knowledge. No one is greater than anybody else. We are the same in a different polarity. And we came here to coexist in harmony. You see, a lot of people blame people in this world. Sometimes you blame the government. Sometimes you blame a woman. Sometimes you blame a man. But what you're dealing with is what Kierkegaard talked of as, as the existential crisis. This is what humanity is dealing with. That you see, like Buddha said, the trouble is you think you have time. No. Planet Earth is an airport. You're here, then you're gone. But you, you don't die because the spirit is immortal. But you're only here for a brief moment in time. So remind yourself, life is all about making the most of this beautiful experience. Not living in war. Not dumbing yourself down. But living a life of love and connecting with beautiful souls. That's what it's all about. Seven day vegan challenge, getting healthy. I've been working out, deep divers. Oh yeah, eating to live, green juice, acai bowls. That's what it's all about. Live your best life. Don't waste your life and be miserable. Wake up saying thank you every single day. This is a gift. One in four trillion. You beat the odds to be a human being. You won the lottery of life and you don't even know it. Oh my gosh, that was a real moment right now. <laughs> if your mind can't handle this kind of truth then i'd probably skip this video but you're still watching deep divers i just wanted to share that powerful message with you here to remind you you are good enough embrace your authenticity that is actually your ticket your golden ticket to live your best life don't hide your imperfections because they're perfect I call them perfect imperfections. And the more people embrace their true authenticity, the better the world will be. You're good enough, deep divers. Woo! I want everybody to hit that like button right now. Share this video. Hit that like button right now because somebody out there needs to see this. And that's why I'm just saying, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful, deep divers. I'm just, woo! breathing in that good ass prana baby <laughs> go and check out the new book deep divers for more powerful life-changing information just like this feel alive by ralph smart on amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book the bible of becoming your greatest version also the new book book of 1111 quotes at ralphsmart.com slash the book also go and get the good ass prana shirts deep divers at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in america and we have all new limited designs in the store. They tried to bury us deep divers. They forgot we were seats. Right now, it's a great time to be alive because a whole worldwide awakening is happening as I'm speaking. A lot of people are saying, you know what? I don't want a fake life anymore. I want an authentic life. I want to be me without pretending. I want to be me. I want to be me without wearing a mask. And deep divers... Continue being the marvelous you unapologetically. I love all of you. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace. You. Once again, deep divers, make sure that you hit that like button. Share the video. Leave a comment down below of gratitude and appreciation. And let me know how this video inspired you to become your greatest version. Remind yourself, deep divers, it only gets better when you get better. I love all of you. Peace, love, and harmony. One love. Peace.